Victor Bray here. I just want to give you a quick rundown on Sid Chrome's top of the range 500 plus toolkits. They're called the 10100 series. They're fabulous in the innovation they have in the design of the kit, as you can actually see. Toolbox itself, as modern as they come. Look fabulous, and the innovations inside the toolbox, where the tools sit, the way they sit in there, and the range of tools you get with these, get with these you need nothing else in your workshop. So we'll start at the top of the toolbox. This is obviously where you want to have your quick grab. All your sockets are in here, your bars, your ratchets, and uh, it's full range, metric, and uh, imperial. So everything's in the top of the toolbox. Sidcrane's been very innovative lately, and they've made a lot of new tools. Very, very uh, interesting, some of the changes that they've made. The new 440 Pro Series is a fantastic line of tools. Anyone that's had one in their hand, if you've been on the tools your whole life, and you get hold of the 440 Series Pro Series Sidcrane tool, and you start using it, you can pick the difference in a minute. They're fantastic, the way they work, the little innovations that they've made in them, and they're easy to use, and they also get into the places where a lot of other tools can't get, and they're stronger, and they look better as well. The 10100 also uses the top of the line toolbox. It has the ball bearing roller toes. Very, when they go back in, you'll see they just retain themselves. Very good. You know, they go straight back into place. Easy to stay there. When you're moving around, they don't want to move out. We'll start at the very top of the toolbox. Over this side, you have all your pliers. You have your circuit pliers and that sort of stuff. Something you use all the time. Who doesn't use an adjustable spanner? We all use them all the time. Nice and handy at the top, as well as the multi grips. Next one down, you've got all your pliers, your uh, side cutters, all that sort of stuff. All in the one area where you can get to them easy. You know where they are. Of course, you can rearrange any of your stuff yourself anywhere, anywhere you want it. All these boxes are the same size, so you can move them up and down and put them wherever you want. Come over this side over here, and you've got to do a quarter drive. Easy to get onto, easy to get into the hard places. Always at the top of the box where you can get hold of them. Next one down, ratchet ring spanners. What a hell of an invention that's been over the years. These ones are getting more and more modern. They're getting finer and finer in the ratchets and we're finding you can get them into more awkward places. Some of the angles they have on the end of them. We've got your hex drives, or your hex drive stop and your torques. Moving to the bottom one here. You've got your T-handle Allen drive, your hex drive T-handles. Both metric and imperial. Moving to the next one, screwdrivers. Uh, there's another good innovation that they've had, the handles on the screwdrivers nowadays. I've seen so much over the years of screwdriver handles that they're good for this, they're good for that. Try one of these new Sidchrome screwdriver handles, there's nothing like them. They grab anything. You also get some longer screwdrivers in this kit, some longer screwdrivers, some shorter ones, and some for getting to awkward positions. There's also smaller ones in there for when you get into the real little positions, the real mini sets. Next one down here, we've got the, uh, the longer extension and stuff for using the socket set all the time. They're always down in there, and your deep series sockets. Always need the deep series sockets. Okay, so now we move on to the bottom box. In the top box, like in everybody's kit, that's that real accessible one. You get down here, you get into the meaty stuff. But there's all your open end of ring spanners. And the beauty of these things is, the way they're laid out, you can get to them all easy. Over the years, obviously, you've seen tool kits that have uh, a little bit of awkward to get to these ones here. Easy grab, easy put back. And they only have to get on the one spot, which is fabulous. Next one, you've got your Imperial, same thing. You've got your Imperial and Metric side by side. And they're right there at the top of the toolbox, right at the waist side, just pull them straight out. Okay, in this drawer, Sucrone grips, a range of shifters. You've got some of their fantastic hammers. If you ever use one of their anti vibe hammers, you'll know what I mean. Fabulous stuff. And we've got some great stuff in here. Look at that. How's that for a range of pliers, mini pliers? Snips, side cutters, pliers, bend ends, everything. Needle nose. Uh, in here we got uh, the flared up spanners. Front of all your brake lines and stuff like that. And uh, we also got a full set of them in metric as well. And some bigger ones too. So uh, that's a great kit, great draw that one. Moving to the next one. Here's all your punches, cold chisels, center punches, hollow punches. Everything's in there. The kit contains every punch you'll ever dream of. You also have your curved spanners for getting those awkward situations, awkward places. Any of the small block Chevy or a big block Chevy would love to know there's one of these in there to do up the Magnet or the distributor. Next down here, we have all your impact drive sockets. So you've got a full range of metric and a full range of imperial. Who doesn't want there when you're trying to get a tough nut out of the rattle gun? And as you always say, don't use the silver ones, use the black ones with the rattle gun. 
Here we also have a, a, a range of uh, bits that actually fit in and turn on the 3.8 uh, span. It's fantastic. It's a full, full set there. There's nothing there, whether you've got all your Allen key sizes, all your torque sizes, you've also got your hex sizes. So, all in the one kit. Next kit down, hacksaw, tension wrench. That's right, with the 10100, you get a fabulous tension wrench. They're great to use, very easy to use. Good, strong hacksaw. And now the bottom tray. Pry bars, look at that. And I'll tell you what, there's not much you can't do with these things. Ask Benny and the boys here in the workshop, mate. They can damage anything with these things, but they're just terrific for getting stuff off. Two levers, they're all angled right, very, very strong. And this is what I love about the 10100. It contains one of Sucrane's new inspection lights, work lights. There's one in the box, that's how they come. You've got the charge in the car, charge out of the 240 volt, and there's the light itself. I've got one here. Now how's that for a work light? These things last a long time, very, very easy to charge. And uh, when you pull them off, they've also got magnets and stuff on them. You can mount them anywhere, stick them anywhere, rotate them any angle you like. They're fabulous. Once you start using these things, you can see how good they are. These are the work light of the future. So there you have it, there's a brief rundown on Synchrome's top of the range 10100 toolkit. They're over 500 piece, uh, as you start to use them you'll see the innovation they have in the tool design, the design of the inserts, the toolboxes, the kits, it's all just so modern, so new, easy to use. The best part about it is that we get to use them in Team Rage Workshop and at the racetrack. The boys absolutely love them. Like I say, it's just the innovations that are in there, you need to own them to see what, exactly what they are. We can tell you about them, but you have to have them. These toolboxes have been awarded to the winners of the Andra Drag Racing Champions every year for the last couple of years. Everybody who's had one over the next couple of months comments on how great they are and how they're so complete, so much stuff in them, it's so easy to use. You need one of these in your workshop.